With our pretty basic start and exploration kind of done, we gotta focus on getting the basics so we don't fall back down to the stone ages and so we can make automatic farms in the future. I also need to focus on expanding out our bee operations so we can get honey blocks because very soon we get to have the lovely job of making all the trades with the villagers, woo! So basically we got a lot of preparation work to get to. So hi everyone, welcome back. Uh, that was a lot bigger of a response for episode one than I was expecting. <laughs> so I, I was reading the comments. I was honestly like just incredibly thrilled and just really happy. Why do you have grass in there? Just to see, and I just, a lot of you feeling the same way as me, just wanting to, no, 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 no. You know, uh, I, I enjoy the slower pace videos, you know, just having like fun in it again, just like the old times. Apparently getting four chickens out of one egg, I think one of you told me that's like a 0. like 0.0026% chance or something. I don't know. But yeah, that, that was wild. But yeah, I, I like I'm incredibly happy that you guys are just feeling the same way about series as me. And also, yeah, you, you guys seem to love the fact that, you know, I don't want to get the elytra. I want to make like some highway systems around here, use a mule, you know, a horse, like all that stuff just to get around. So incredibly excited. So the future of the series is looking very, very good. I feel like I should also mention that last week, like when this is going live, you know, uh, it was like 100 days pal world. So yeah, it, that was supposed to be this episode, but then the video before pal world like that one detective one um yeah that one was accidental i just uploaded it on this channel because i was scared to upload it on the main so don't worry this is still going to be a bi-weekly series like i i didn't forget about it like it's it's not going to be slow don't worry and let's see so we have a metric ton of dirt but we don't have we have like no stone whatsoever do i even have iron I think iron was another thing that i was struggling with in here no i wasn't okay good good so what we're going to do because I just want to go and build the iron farm immediately, but I don't want to make it out of dirt or just like ugly blocks. Like I would at least like to, you know, make it a little bit pretty, maybe, hopefully. So, okay, why does this pathway look so weird to me? But here, let's go back over to the mine because maybe I can find deep slate in there if I'm lucky. But again, I just want to say thank you guys so much for the response on episode one. Like, it honestly blew me and Darman away. Like, it was... There, there was just so much support and love on it. Like, just thank you guys. Oh, and then I guess like a nice little uh, sneak peek for everyone that watches this video. Uh, the main channel's hardcore series is coming back. I I'm changing it to be somewhat like this series where it's just a lot more laid back. And then every episode is just me doing whatever instead of like some big tasks. So I I'm not going to be like anxious to play on that world anymore. Like it'll actually be uh, getting uploaded. And look at how gorgeous this mine is. Like, I'm actually so thrilled with it, and yeah, we're, we're definitely going to be keeping up the effort on everything. Okay, so I remember I specifically left this area just completely unexplored, and you know what, let's just collect everything, because I might use copper for build in the future. I don't- oh, no, 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 no. We definitely need to collect string again. I remember I turned all of my string into wool for some reason. Oh no, I'm trapped. Oh, I don't like that. Uh Oh god. Oh no. And I already hear the spiders. No, no. Please don't become sentient and walk over here, please. Okay. So, didn't I oh, and hello. Okay. Well, I was going to say I didn't go down here last time and uh please something good. Oh. <gasps> okay, amazing. I <laughs> Wow, I'm actually really happy that I came down here. I needed that for the iron farm, so that saves me having to try to find a, uh, a zombie that holds a block, so awesome. And hello, rails, which I probably shouldn't be collecting with my pick because it's just going to be wasting the durability on it. And I don't even think that there's like that much of a difference in speed. Never mind, I am not that patient. <laughs> And just because why not, we might as well just collect all of the fences in here. Basically, it's just time to go through and start stripping down the entire mine. Okay. Oh god, wait, that was my sword? Oh. 
Okay, well, I didn't realize that it was uh, that low. I don't know how I missed that. I'm just so observant, and I just notice everything. Oh, okay. I have to say, coming here, like, right after recording my hardcore episode, oh my god, I miss netherite maxed out tools. Oh, we need a rush for that. <laughs> Before we start building, like, any bridges or any mega structure, yeah, no, I, we have to get maxed out uh, tools and armor. That is so unbelievably needed. Oh, no, I just realized we're not going to the end at all. I can't make a, um, a gravity block duplicator machine. With the stronghold. Oh, God. Well, uh, all of our mega structures just became a lot more tedious. Oh, joy. I think for the first time in my life, I actually want to build a clock and keep it with me. Especially, you know, like when we're going around in the mines and stuff. Like, just imagine actually having a clock. Just so I know, like, when I could sleep, but I probably wouldn't because I'm pretty sure that when it's nighttime... Mobs actually don't spawn down here. Like, they'll actually just spawn on top at the surface. Oh, my God. Oh, no, I don't have a sword. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hi. Oh, my God. Uh, okay. Maybe we should actually head back. Oh, my God. Maybe we really should head back home. No. No, 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 no. There we go. Oh my god, I hate fighting without a sword. Like, I, I understand the axe is a lot stronger. A lot of you were probably like, Oh, why are you scared to attack it with your axe? You'll kill it easy. No, I hate it. I, I don't like the axe. It attacks so slow. I'm more about speed. Call me Lightning McQueen. That was a good joke, right? You like that one, Darman? Right? You laughed at it? Okay, good. Yeah, you laughed at it. I also like how I came over here for some cobblestone so I can make the iron farm, and then I just completely ignore it. I mean, wait, we don't actually need any stone. I, I forgot the name of the guy who made it. I think it was, like, Wumbles was his name. We actually don't need, like, is it called, like, unflammable? Inflammable object? Things that don't burn up. Like, you actually don't need it. You only need it down below with the lava collection system, which I can already make walls. So we're good there. So up top, I can actually just focus on making it look really pretty. You know, I can just work on making it look like Darman, you know? <laughs> just make it very gorgeous. Okay, well, there goes all of that. I'm not gonna collect any more wooden stuff. Uh, I mean, the mineshaft isn't that pathetic so far, you know? Like it's, it's like a little all right. Oh, hi. Oh, oh, hi. Just want to make it as safe as possible. Don't want... Did I put this here? That looks very me. Wait. Oh, that is me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because there was like lava or something around here. And then, yeah, yeah, I put that down so I could pick it up. Ah. Interesting. Okay, please don't go down there. Oh, hi. Uh, I really don't like that. Please don't get rid of any of my torches. <sighs> ah, that definitely got rid of some torches. I saw it get dark. Come on. No, no. Hi. No, 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 no. Oh my god. Okay, well, hello, giant cave system. Nice. Okay, we should actually be able to find some resources in here. I'm so scared of getting lost. I think I can actually make... Oh god, what was it called? There was like a, like a lodestone, and then you have to make a compass, and then, you know, you can always find your way back home. Definitely need to get that. I, I'm pretty sure I can get all... No, no, I can get all that stuff without the end. So that's definitely one thing that we need back at our base because I just, I, I don't like writing down coordinates, dude. It's such a nerd thing. And I'm not a nerd, okay? I'm a Chad. I'm very cool. Oh god, I hear him. No. 
No. Hiram is in the walls. He's in the walls. <gasps> ah, I see dead people. Oh. Mommy, I see dead people. Oh my god, no, no, no. I don't have any weapon. Uh, That can kill me. That can kill me. That can kill me. Uh, Way out of here. I think it was down here. Yes, left, and let me just go straight. Yeah, nope, never mind. I know I'm in survival. I don't need to care about dying, but like, I would like to try and do it as little as possible. Wow, nice. We collected 58 <laughs> cobblestone. Wow, that was, that was a really good run. Good job, me. I think iron golems can't spawn on leaves. Like, I'm pretty sure they can't because that does count as an air block, and that's why they can't like spawn on glass, which I know is safe. So I'm trying to think of how to make the iron farm not just butt ugly, you know, just to have some kind of a personality and actually be beautiful. Ah, oh, man, but it just, it sucks because so early on, I mean, regardless, just like in the hardcore episode, you know, episode 12, we're gonna have to take down all of the buildings in the future and just rebuild them to the style that I want in the future. But that's like very end late game, you know? So I guess... I don't know, like, maybe we just don't really try to make anything that we know will be making pretty in the future beautiful right now? You know, like, maybe we just save ourselves the resources and the time? Part of me wishes that I live stream this, because then I could just ask you guys that live, and then I could just quickly get an answer and, like, you know, get an idea of what to do, instead of, you know, asking on a video and then having to wait, like, a week or two. <laughs> okay, but cool, we can make beet roots. Um, don't know why I would ever want to do that. I, I actually don't see the purpose in that. That's right, I remember I was exploring for a blast furnace because I didn't want to make one. How do you make those? Uh, you. Awesome. Okay, yeah, you're a little pricey. Also, I gotta know, because I'm just having difficulties with it on the hardcore world, do you guys think that I should just flatten down this entire area, make it like one level? You know, we'll raise up there, we'll lower that down, lower down, you know, the hills and like flatten out this area so we have like a nice big area to work on. Or should I try and keep it like somewhat natural? Like I'm still, like no matter what, I'm gonna touch up the area. Like, should I keep it, like, a little bit more natural to where it's a little bit more, like, hilly in areas? And then that's where I'm building. Like, I'll try to incorporate my builds into there. Wait, wait, really quick. If you're enjoying the video so far, I'm really close to 1 million subscribers, and it'd mean a lot to me if you'd subscribe and help me reach it. It helps me out tremendously with making these videos possible, and leave a like if you'd like to see more. Thank you. Now, back to the video. Oh my god, hello. Why do I have so much bread? What? what? Huh? Wait, how do I have so much bread? Red. I don't ever remember making that. Wait, why do I have that? Oh, wait, the villages. Oh, oh those might have more. Okay, I might not actually have to cook any stone. Uh, it, before you even ask yourself, yes, I am crazy enough to travel back to all of the villages and then see if I could find some smooth stone instead of literally just cooking one. Like, yes, I, I am I am actually that like petty, if you want to say. Like, I, I don't know what to call it, but yes, I, I actually would do that. Okay, maybe we do need to start a tree farm. I don't even really have that much wood. So maybe we should start like somewhat of a tree farm somewhere. Or at least just like a little patch of an area for a tree. And then I'm definitely going to be turning all of these logs into charcoal. Uh, it, this is so weird to actually have to go uh, mining. Like, it, it's very bizarre to me j to like not have, you know, 20,000 of every single block. Because of how many like giant 100 by 100 holes I've made. I'm also getting PTSD because I literally just spent two and a half days going around doing this. My hardcore world, I, I wish I could say that I'm joking, but oh my god, that was actually torturous. Okay, and then if we just wait for all of them to grow, you know, very luckily I got the tree cutting mod, and yeah, we could just knock those bad boys out immediately, start getting some charcoal. It's so weird, I'm at like the stage in the game to where there's just so much to do that I don't know what to do. Okay, now, oh my god, he's getting so much action. I'm sorry, ladies, ladies, I'm so sorry. Here, let me, let me take him. I don't worry, he'll be back. Okay, so, oh wait, I never named him. I mean, we did just get the name tag, but like, I, I want to. Mm. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, everyone. Sorry, chat. You know, whatever you want me to call you. I'm definitely gonna save that name tag for the zombie, not not the donkey. I'm I'm sorry. Also, yeah, I I remember I asked this a lot, but like, it just never goes anywhere. <laughs> 
So I think it just immediately just turns into a joke and then I just start cracking jokes and then I just start laughing about all of it. Should I have like a subscriber base name, you know? Like uh, I know like other creators out there have names for their subscribers. I don't, but um, like, should I? You know, like, are you guys down for that? Like, do you guys want a name? And then if you do, like, what should we call it? Right, since this one was so tiny, I don't expect to actually find anything here. How did I miss all of that? Oh, that's why I have so much bread. Yeah, yeah, yeah I remember. It's because I went around and I was collecting these at every single village. Uh, I'm not going to break that with my hand and I don't feel like making a hoe because, like, I'm a respectful man and... We'll, we'll just do that later. Okay. No! Key! Oh my god. Okay. Yep. You almost just fell. You... Okay. Good, good. You do have apples to heal up. But yeah. Nope. Don't want to take you off a cliff. We definitely need to breed this donkey with a horse. Like, it, maybe this episode or next episode. But we, we definitely need to make it to where we can get the fastest mule possible. Like, a horse would be cool. But let's be honest. I loot a lot. So I think mules are the way to go. Just so I can have a chest on them. Because I will need the storage. I wonder if I should install a backpack mod. I mean, like, maybe, but then that almost feels like it's just kind of cheating. Because it's like, oh, okay, well, you're not going to get shulkers, but then you have a backpack. And then if you have a backpack, there's no point for a shulker. Plus, like, I, I do want to, like, you know, make this known or iterate this, you know. Um, I am going to go to the end at some point. It's just not going to be for a while. Just because, like, I just want to, like, fully, you know, develop the overworld. And then also, I don't think, uh, at least in this series, I don't think I will ever get an Elytra. Or if I do, it's gonna be in a long, long time. I just, I, I don't have any... Okay, don't go anywhere. I just don't have any urges to get it right now because I, I like the idea of having to make a lot of transport systems and, like, going around everywhere. Okay, nothing there. Come on, I know one of you has it. One of you has a smooth block. Come on. I don't bite unless you want me to. Okay, wow. Maybe you guys really don't. Ah, what did I just pick up? Oh. Why, why did I drop a stone hoe? Uh, no. Okay, I, I'm not going to do it or else and it's going to take me like uh, two weeks to record this episode as well. Just like the hardcore one. So yeah, no, never mind. Okay, let's just go home. I'll sacrifice it, you know. I'll go and cook one cobblestone. <laughs> I also just wanted to explore. I miss this world. Oh, 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 okay. Oh my God. I can't believe you didn't take any damage. Whew. Okay. Why, why are we going this way? And what are we doing? Okay. I'm starting to understand why I was going that way. Oh my God. We need, we need to build a bridge. Oh my God. I'm going through a war zone right now. Why do I hear a skeleton? You already know it. Yep, nope, I had to come back here for this. See, at least it was worthwhile, you know? We got something out of this trip. You can do it, little buddy. There you go. Okay. Oh, that was a fun trip. I wonder if I should just, you know, bone meal all of this because, um... I got a little bit of bread, you know, um, I, um, I can make a few villagers with it as I already have. Oh my god. I think I need a lot of those, though. Again, like, it's always something that I want to do, but, like, I never do it in any of my series. Like, the raft one, you know? Like, on a raft, how I wanted to get, like, every single villager and have, like, this really cool trading area, but then, you know, kind of accidentally deleted the world, and then my backup was, like, super old, so I just didn't want to play on it anymore. Yeah. But at least on here, I'm very confident I'm not going to be deleting this world by accident, because I don't have the replay mod, but, yeah, I... I think I want to go for all villager trades. I think for storage, I'll just make all of that into bread later. Okay, then go to a boop and then bop, bing, and boom. Okay, perfect. And then you can go right there. And now I need even more coal for all of that stuff. I'm in here. I, I hope I'm going to make all of you very proud of me. I'm going to go and be a brave boy and I'm just going to go mining again, which, you know, it's oh God, terrifying down there. Very scared of it. But it, yeah, I think I just need to keep on going for more resources before we start building anything. Why am I going mining again? Oh, coal. No, uh, coal and cobblestone. That's why I was doing that. That's right. I kind of forgot why I was going over there. <laughs> I need to remind myself. We also need to kind of spawn proof our entire area. Like I, I need to go around with torches and start lighting up the entire place. I don't like it how, you know, I could just, you know, be chopping down a tree and then, you know, back gets blown out by Shrek's green... 
Why, hello there. Oh my goodness, what are you doing over here? Uh, cool, wow, you sell literally nothing of use. But hi, you two. Yes, oh my god, yes, queen. Oh my god, thank you so much for those. Don't worry, I'm... I'll at least be generous with this, you know, I'll, I'll leave him alive. Oh, that's right. Dude, I planted so many trees. Oh, oh, I guess I kind of do have a little tree farm. Probably should go around and, you know, chop all these down. I could really use the charcoal, but I need to not get distracted. I, I need to be good boy, go mining. I yearn for the mines. Should really explore this area right here too, huh? Let's see, can I like park where my way? Yes. Okay, yes, queen, yes, perfect, okay. I see you. I cannot please, nothing spawn over here. Oh, I mean, this is gonna be a little dip, oh. That's right, I have armor now, okay, yeah. I, I, I don't know why, I just, I, I remember a skeleton just like, almost killing me, but yeah, I think that was like the previous world before I made a new one. Okay, but uh, anyways. We should also probably try- uh, I mean, it's incredibly difficult to do it. Like, it's actually tedious, but, you know, making a wither skeleton farm? Because then I would get bones, most importantly, I'd get stone swords, and I would also get coal. Plus, then I can also get their heads, which, you know, who would ever complain about getting, you know, a skeleton head? Um, <laughs> and then I can also, you know, make the wither and then, you know, come and make a beacon. <laughs> Oh, you're so little. Aww. Dude, you are so a baby girl, just like me. <laughs> I know you're not gonna put that in, but you can. Uh, don't like, really don't like that area. Please, nothing come over here. I, I at least just want to get the iron, and then I'll get out of here, please. Oh, <gasps> hi. Dude, how are you, gorgeous? Oh, yes, no, you are really nice. Okay, that's actually incredible. Thank you so much for that. That's not even me being ironic or sarcastic. Oh, oh God, we're down here. Okay. So, I didn't really spawn proof this entire area like whatsoever. Jesus Christ, bat, okay. I, dude, that sounded like a creeper lighting up. No, I hear you. Please don't. Like, again, I know that I'm in survival. I don't need to worry about dying, but why am I more scared about dying in this world than I am in my hardcore one? Hi. Oh, God. Okay, I see a lot down there. Hi, buddy. You seem like you have anger issues. Do you need... To okay, yeah, I was gonna say, do you need to work it out with me? But, you no, know, you're just a little brat. Okay, am I safe enough to mine? That's a no. Wait, what? Dude, this entire place is such a, like a spaghetti mess. Like it's weird. I, I'm not expecting to like be near any of the tunnels that I've like been exploring, but somehow I am. Really nice. It's always so weird to travel so far underground and then just not see anything. Like I always feel like their spawn rates are just too low. Like I'm not expecting, you know, like an endless anime fight, you know, getting through 700 enemies just to reach the one iron, but it's like, it's very weird, just how calm it is. I hear you. Really wish that I could see you. Yeah, exactly. Like I just, I randomly find areas that I've lit up before. This, okay, yeah, yeah. This is when I was running out of torches and then I turned around to run. Cause I think I saw a skeleton and I forgot I had armor. Even though I can just look and see that I have almost a full iron, you know, row. Nope, I'm good. Oh, Jesus Christ. Why did that scare me? Why? Why did that scare me? Oh, nice. Nice deep hole. Always wanted to explore those. Oh, no. My pick. No. Oh, what am I going to do now? Too much copper. For an ore with literally no use at all. Like, why do they spawn it so much? Okay, I need to find the uh, the abandoned mineway railroad? Mine shaft? Whatever the hell it's called. But I need to find it again. But, oh, God, I'm getting all turned around. It's all good, though. I'm not known as the master navigator for no reason. Okay, there we go. See here, if I just start breaking these, very luckily I've been finding coal so I can make more torches so we can just keep going. And boop, okay. Lovely, we're finding so much, like, yes, queen. 
Okay, um, let's just go back up there. Oh, hi. Hello. How did I always miss you? Oh, I just realized as well, once we make uh, like some uh, like railroads and like mineways around everywhere, I can actually use the minecart furnace. So I don't really need to use like any powered rails at all. I mean, it's it's going to be slow, so it's probably not going to last for that long. It's like I, I do actually want to make them all like pretty efficient. So I think it's like boat and ice way. It's probably going to be our, our best bet. I don't know. What are you guys thinking? Oh, hi. Okay, chill, 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 chill. Damn. Man, dude, you're a little bit too excited to, like, explode all over me. Jesus. Man, you seem desperate, okay? It's not attractive. You got to calm down. There we go. Please, nothing spawn over here anymore. Hello, beautiful. I feel so embraced. It was so nice to get some uppies. It's tough for us five foot eight men out here not getting uppies. I just want to be cradled. <laughs> I hear you. Where are you? Okay, so let me take a wild guess. There's a floor below us, and the only way that I'm going to find a way down there is if I just break through the ground. Just running around here trying to find... A pathway down, it's not really working for me, Chief. And wait, 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 wait. Did I put that? Did I put that or is that a little dungeon? Oh, no, 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 no. Never mind. That's the water. I remember that now. Okay, so very interesting area okay cool cool nice and creepy awesome i love horror games i love scary things i don't know i i love hearing all of these sounds around me like something is just gonna grab me out of the darkness love that i want to get all that iron so badly oh hey look i'm gonna get all that iron so badly hey whoa it's me i'm so little no one jump out at me okay there you go so you just gotta get like Give them some false hope, because, you know, if there's someone that's, like, 4'11 coming by, I don't think you would, you know, load up the guns. Yes. Oh, but thank God we came down to the scary places, because there's so much iron everywhere. Like, hey, beautiful. Oh, no, please give me enough for, like, three stacks. I would not be against it. At that point, I'm, I actually think that we would uh, just go make the iron farm. If I can, I think I need nine, a at least in the beginning, I just need nine hoppers. And then after that, I might expand it a little bit, but just want to get enough for nine. No, I just noticed. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, that was, that was worth the one string. That was worth the one string. You know what? Nah, I, I, I needed flint. That's why I did it. Oh, hi. Ooh. Ooh. Got me blushing over here. Hello. Ooh. Oh, no. Uh. Okay, not too good. Oh, but nice. We have over, over a stack of that one. So we don't need to come back in here. So that's awesome. Um. Okay, well, we'll just put something in the offhand. There, we'll just do that. Okay, let's see. Now, can we find the way out of here? Ah, oh, but there's more rails. I can't help it. I need to collect them. It's, it, I just... It's its the loot goblin in me, okay? It's... Uh, it's like the goblin mask, you know, from Spider-Man, where it just it, it talks to me. It's like, take me. Don't leave me behind. Like, it just, it, it just says sweet things in my ear like that, in a very, like, nice and smoothing voice. Like... Take me, you know, like just things that you would like to hear at midnight. I get to hear that all the time. Hi, don't come over here. Thanks for listening, Pookie. We're just cool like that. What kind of song? Oh, come on. Uh, don't care for B-Roots, gotta be honest. Much rather have coal. Let's see. Are you gonna be cool? And Okay. Couldn't even finish that sentence. Literally, just couldn't even talk to you. Okay. Can you stop it? Stop. No, don't blow up on me. No, no. There you go. Edge the creeper. There you go. Yep. Nice. Nice. Go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I gotta make it the last one and then run. Oh my god. Okay, I... Trust me, I like having all this iron, but like, come on, I gotta go. I need to run. And... Boop. Oh my god, I can't help it, but look at all the rails. I need these. Think of all the iron I'm saving. Oh, and then there's just more iron. Oh, and then there's just more iron. 
Nope, I'm good. Nope, I am good. I see a shaft and I run. Oh my gosh, you just know how to speak to me. Oh, that's right. I guess you can have railings go into the ocean. And then I think if I have like a, a powered minecart right behind me, like a furnace minecart, I think I can actually have that push me through the water. So like in a sense, like if I were to ever make a underwater base, we could have a pretty dope entrance, you know? Like we could totally just have like a, oh, I see you. Ooh, I want you. We could totally have like a secret underwater uh, like entrance going to it. Just have it be like really cool and stuff. So beautiful. Uh, I'm actually okay with that one. Uh, love that. Don't care. And I uh, will take... <sighs> I should take the minecart. Uh, uh, goodbye, Andesite. Why not? Ooh, hello. No, no, I wasn't saying hello to you. No, 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 or you. No, no, it's okay. Man, it has been so long since I've explored one of these. This is actually fun. It's, it's nice. Like, I'm actually enjoying this series so much. Like, it actually makes me want to play. Oh, God. Okay, well, there's another floor up there. There's no shot. I just heard that little goblin. A little goblin trader. It's where, like, you know, I give him one raw iron and he gives me back, like, two cooked ones. Did I actually just hear him? Oh, man, but if I did, that sucks. I can't carry him back to my house and I don't want to trade down here because I don't have any inventory space. Oh, don't fall. Nope, nope, nope. Don't want to explore. Don't want to explore. Okay, I need, I need to stop looking around. I, I need find exit. Exit. No more looting. I need my goblin mask to shut up. Okay, we don't don't need to do that anymore. And I think we just found the entrance. That w crazy, unbelievably fast. Okay, didn't realize. Ooh, oh, wait, ooh, no. Didn't realize I was that close to uh, this place. I th think it's nighttime. No, okay. Looks nice, but dude, amazing though. Like that was actually a really really nice run. We got a lot of nice resources. Oh, nice. High noon. Every single Overwatch player just got, like, PTSD from me saying that. Ooh, boy! Man, look at our gorgeous base. I think I need to make everything that level because I really don't want to redo the farms. <laughs> so I think I just, like, prematurely started the base. Like, the future base. Okay. A uh, lot to put away. By the way, I absolutely love this mod. I think it's called Mouse Tweaks. I think that's what it's called, where you just click and hold, and then anything that can go into the chest, it goes into it. It's phenomenal work. Okay, we'll put you into there. Start on that. Here you go. I'm also a little curious if there's, like, some kind of, um, like, chunk loader mod, you know? And then, like, I just keep it over here, and then this would just continue cooking when I'm not here. It's not really important, but I'm just curious. Wait, is that actually... Oh my god, wait, that's actually the first two leads. Oh, that I've ever gotten. Oh. Okay, wait, that's huge. Okay, sick. It's way right here. Uh, Donkey, like, I don't know what to call him, but hey, Donkey, wait right here. You don't have to stay with all your girlfriends anymore. Now you can, you know, ghost them. And I'll make them want you. Okay, uh, but I will keep you right there, though. And hello, eggs. Ooh, we should probably start... No, I'm trying not to hate you guys. I'm sorry. But I should probably start on the automatic chicken, like, egg collector farm that I always make in every world. Because, I mean, you know, we got the iron for it. Don't need to worry about that whatsoever. Dude, that's actually so nice. We have 50. 50 cooked ones. We got a lot cooking in there. Dude, we're actually doing good for once. I just realized that I'm holding the bone. <laughs> At least for an iron farm. Like, I'm trying to think of, like, what's the least ugliest spot? Because we need it somewhat close to base. Or, like, I don't care for it to be that close. Hmm. I mean, maybe, ooh, maybe, like, right, right about here? I don't think that's that far from the base. Actually, not here. Well, we'll make it around here because I'm scared about putting it even farther away because I don't want, I don't want it to stop. Like when I'm just, you know, one block over, one little tiny hill over building something else. We, we need this to actually be working quite often. And let's be real, I'm probably going to have to build multiple of these. So then there's at least always one working, depending on where I am. So like we'll build one here and then maybe one on like top of the hill or like past that hill, you know? Because I'm trying to think, like we... We might be using ice a lot, because maybe the ice boatways is how we're going to get around the area, but it would also be really nice just to load up a minecart and then just go, and then not have to, like, 
actually move myself. I could just, like, sit back and relax, you know? And perfect. That should be good enough. I just don't really feel like making it look, like, super clean and pretty. Because, again, I don't know how much I'm going to be terraforming, you know, around the areas. If I'm going to be lowering the spot or raising it. And... In the future, when I make it look pretty, you know, and, like, make really nice big builds, most likely tearing this down. So it's like, I don't really feel like just, like, putting that much effort into making it nice. I almost just fell with that. There we go. This is a good starting one. I like it. Nice. That bugs me. Yes, an entire stack of iron. What a glorious sight. I mean, it's still gonna be, like, pretty ugly, but maybe it's not gonna be that ugly, but, you know, maybe we just make it out of, like, oak stuff. Might be the nicest. And then I think I only need 10? Wait, oh. No, wait. I've never made glass. Oh, God. One of these days, like, maybe for a live stream or something, but dude, I just, I need to focus on just getting, like, a metric ton of resources. Oh, hey, there's a desert. Nice, okay, a few. I was gonna go in the water. All right, but I, I don't think I'll be doing that for a while, you know, because I, I just, I need to get maxed out everything so that when I go and try to get everything, you know, oh. Wait. How, how long has this been here? How did... Have I seen this before? Well, I mean, there's still loot here, so that's definitely no. How long has there been a village here? How did I never notice? Dog, my house is literally right... No. I, I had to have seen this when I was running there. I... Wait, I wouldn't have left a smoker, though. Or this stuff. What? Dude, I'm so confused. Did I actually miss this tiny little village when I first, you know, created this world? How did I do that? <laughs> Okay, sweet. I guess I got another village right here if I ever need some villagers. I'm so confused on how I've never seen this one before. I, I can't believe Darman kept it hidden from me. But yeah, uh, as I was saying before, maybe I'll do a live stream once I get some like maxed out tools and then we're just gonna go like heavy focused on getting resources, which I don't think I'll turn the live stream into a video. So, you know, if you wanna see me do it, just go to the live stream, you know? But anyways, like it'll, it would be uploaded to the VODs channel. I think I call it Skies Live. And this, we already have over two stacks. It, it's just one of the greatest ways to go and get sand. Like there's really no point in ever using a shovel on this unless it's maxed out. Okay. Okay, that should be enough glass for, you know, quite some time. Probably would be a smart idea to actually have several furnaces. I don't know why I always, like, only make one. And then I just stick with that one. Okay, let's see. Uh, luckily, we still have some coal, so... Well, we let all of this cook because I just... I don't want to start the farm until everything is actually prepared for it. I don't know why. I just... I hate starting a farm and then having to like keep go uh, back and forth just for more material. Uh, while that's all going, we should really probably start on the charcoal. God, I love tree cutting mods so much. Oh, dude, this is amazing. Makes me blush. Also, I really, really would like some feedback on this one. I believe this video, I'm now trying out a new artist for my thumbnails. It's actually Mr. Fox's partner with it, so we're trying out hand-drawn thumbnails for this one instead of just, like, in uh, So we're trying out hand-drawn thumbnails for this instead of hand-drawn thumbnails. And I'm just curious, do you guys like it more, or do you prefer, like, the old thumbnails, like, where it's, like, uh, in-game screenshots and you can actually, like, accurately see the game, or do you like it when it's drawn and, you know, we could put some emphasis on stuff and just make it look cooler? We'd really like some feedback on that one, because we're going to be testing it out on this channel, and then if you guys enjoy it enough, if you, if you like it, then I think I'm going to also do it on the main channel. Okay, so I've been preparing everything, which I... Like, off the top of my head, I, I think this is everything that I need. I don't really think that I'm missing anything. Uh, we need to go find some lava, which... I think that's lava right there. Like, it's kind of funny. I think I've actually memorized how to make iron farms now, so I don't even need to look up the tutorial anymore. So that's nice. Uh, yoink. And then, believe it or not, I think we're actually almost ready to begin our first mega build because like off the top of my head like we just need to make this iron farm which will just give me unlimited iron that we can also use for selling and then i can make a lot of other automatic farms with it we got the bamboo for sticks so 
I think episode three, we're going to be messing with the villagers and making, you know, try to get like all of the trades from them and then just getting like a lot of emeralds. Jesus Christ, you guys are still going? Dang, how much food did I give you? Nice, keep it up. But then after that, like episode three, we should get like maxed out uh, diamond gear and uh, armor. So I, I think after that, we then just start making some concrete, you know? Which I, I still don't think that I want to make like white concrete. I kind of want to like do something different. Maybe we go black. Like instead of like all white builds, maybe I go like all black builds and then everything just looks like a lot more like dark and mysterious and cool. And also just so it doesn't look like it's identical to, you know, my hardcore series. <laughs> yeah, like I think episode four, if everything goes according to my plan and I could just keep up with all of the... Uh, you know, like if we could just like truck through all the difficult parts, like the tedious stuff, we actually should be able to start a uh, mega builds, which I think the first one should probably, I mean, I, I, you guys can help me out with this one, but like maybe our first mega build is our house. It's like, we still need a base of operations and like if we start our house, we can kind of connect like a villager place right next to it. Cause like, I, I still don't want to make like anything nice right now because I know none of this is going to be permanent. But I'm also curious, like, do you guys just want me to make my own idea of a mega build? Or would you like to see like a specific shape, a design? Like, do you want me to make like a pyramid? Do you want me to make like a giant cube rectangle thing? Or I don't know, just like a futuristic industrial looking building, you know? I'm, I'm down for whatever. Oh, yes. And we've been getting a ton of charcoals. This is awesome. There we go. Okay. Oh, I mean, well, this is well over more than enough glass. So that's awesome. Okay. I, I think we're ready. Don't think I need anything else. Yeah. Off the top of my head. I mean, this should be everything. And then, oh dear God, thank the, thank the heavens. I have the carry on mod so I can actually lift up these villagers. Where's the place over here? But I think I'm kind of down for a, uh, like a black concrete builds instead of white. But then I don't know how to make it like not look evil. And we'll just make it 20 high. I think that's how high that we need to make it. And then here, this will be where the zombie goes, which I'm honestly just hoping that it doesn't catch on fire. <laughs> but I don't like at that point, if the lava can reach up here and actually catch this building on fire, honestly, it deserves the W because that's just very impressive. Now, is this the most efficient iron farm? Probably not. Oh no, all of the grass down there. No, man, I wanted it so badly. Oh. Okay, and then I should keep the zombie all nice and safe. And okay, uh, well, let's see, it's almost night time, uh, like I want to move the villagers in here, but it's actually probably like the safest if I don't. So here, let's just start preparing for the zombie, which we just need to do it like this. Oh my God, dang it. Oh, I hate it when I do this. Oh, yeah, I thought I was going to start falling to my death. Woo. Barely enough oxygen. Okay, let's see. We can remove you and we can remove you. I don't think I am doing any big no-nos. And then I just start removing you. <clears throat> oh, no. That's what I was forgetting. Dang it. I forgot to make the stupid name tag. Oh, man. Darman, why didn't you warn me? Okay, I think it's up to this block. Which I think, like, right here is going to be good enough. Oh, man. Wait, that's also right. I never found any anvils when I was exploring all of those villages. Oh, man. Now I have to use my own resources. Uh, sucks. I don't know how I always do this where, like, I almost line it up perfectly or I line it up perfectly. As Darman would say it, I'm probably just ex especially good at it. <laughs> it's especially. Where's the X? It's not X specially. You're X specially stupid. How do you feel about that? Okay, but I don't want things to, like, spawn around here. Please, nothing spawn in my base. Yeah, this is also probably going to be an episode three thing where... Actually, probably episode four. Episode four or three, because we need to do terraforming. 
So episode three might be too much to go through and do like all of the villagers and get diamond armor and gear. Okay, so maybe mega build is episode five. Plus I also need to get all the resources for it. Okay, but very quickly before we go and do anything else, we need to quickly make an iron anvil. I need four, right? Okay, no, no, it was just three. There you go, boom. Don't care though that I have to use that. And then boom, you could just stay on top. So you're constantly getting cut. I think that'd be really good for it. There you are. There you go. Sub to Skies 2. That's what everyone should be doing. Thank you guys so much for all of these subscriptions. How did I miss this? Okay, let's see. Zombie. Is any zombie out there looking for a pookie bear? I can bark. Like, come on. Come on out. Ooh, oh, dude, yes. We can have an enchanted... That's a zombie, right? Okay, good. Don't, don't touch me. No, I'm done touching. Don't touch the merchandise. Thank you very much. Hi, buddy. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship going to the iron farm i only want this one i still don't have a bow i'll just buy one from like a fletching zombie a zombie no a fletching villager sorry he just has me all flustered is there one behind you no okay come here come give me huggy oh okay so don't jump get down boy there we go hi sorry only one pookie allowed no don't need you sorry snookums oh pookies who's ready to be tortured for eternity so i get iron oh whoop uh nah, i should be able to parkour with your fat head in front of me hello jesus christ okay let's see fallen perfect okay okay Dude, he's just like staring at me. He has such like dark and mysterious eyes. It's making me feel some kind of way. And we'll just take you because I think you have a job. Where did he go? Wait. Oh God. Wait, where did... Where's the creeper? I know they don't despawn. No. All right. Okay. Let me get your big forehead out of the way. Uh. Well, okay. I mean... You know, maybe he actually just despawned, you know? Maybe he doesn't, you know, want to hurt me. Okay, uh, let's just start cleaning up all of you, because why not? But all right, basically it's done already. So now, if I just head back up... Hi, everyone. Are you guys ready to be uh, encased forever? And then for anyone that doesn't know, basically you just go around to like every single block like this and then you just, you know, just start covering it up like that. Don't miss any corners. Except I already messed up because actually what we need to do is these last three, specifically right here. I just realized I didn't... No, no, I think I built it kind of like in the right spot. But yeah, here, we just put some staircases right here, just like that. And then we just go through and then start covering up everything. Just like this. Wow, so amazing and so difficult to do. I can't wait to tear this down and actually make it look really nice. <laughs> but knowing me, I'm probably never going to do that. Like, let's be real. I'm probably just going to leave it like this until like a dozen episodes later. Okay, but then we take you, and then we just cut that across, and then we bring this up one more level. Oh my god, I never moved the water. <laughs> oh, that's awkward. And then, I think this goes out by one? No. No, 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 I don't think it does. God, I, I just, 
I keep forgetting because where the signs... Oh, no, 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 no. It has to, yeah. Because the signs have to go out here. There we go. See, I don't know why Darman forgot that. Like, how that, that could have been detrimental and embarrassing. Okay, but basically, I think this should be everything. Uh, we just now need to go and get a whole lot of water. Of which, let's... Let me not take that, actually. No. Because I need to take that back up there so I can remove all of the dirt blocks. So, no, never mind. I didn't accidentally leave that up there. I was just so smart and I purposely left it. Is the water racing me to the ocean or something? Because I won. And then I put one there. Then you put it to the block, right? Like, across from it. Then you take the one in the center. And then now we just have infinite water. Okay, we're all good. Yes, perfect, amazing. Okay, we should be good. This is very weirdly having a different kind of like waterway. I think it's because we're in 1.18. Yeah, we're in 1.18.1 instead of 1.19 when I normally make this, but we should be entirely done down here. We just now need to go down here and then... I think like right here. So I think on this block. Because one, two, three. Okay, I, th I think this is the right spot. So yeah, so let me just come out to here. Two, three, boom, boom. Yes. And of course I didn't bring any chests. See, I knew Darman was forgetting something. However, I do know that sometimes the iron can be very annoying and actually fall in between this. So, now that I've already mapped out exactly where the chute needs to be, let's just remove all of the bottom walls so that then in the future, like, I can just come back here and add more hoppers around this so that then we get 100% of everything. So, just like that. Nice. And then... We go up. I think we just need to go up, like, two more, like this. Oh my god, I had the perfect amount of walls. That might be bad. I, I might actually need to kill you. Uh, I don't think I have any mobs that, like, he'll target out here, but I just, I don't trust iron golems walking around plus i think he's actually gonna mess with my spawn rates uh hi buddy there you go boop okay and then we run i'm gonna go up four because i don't trust you like why are you why are you going over there why do you just want to like why do you want to stare at me all weird Okay, so hi guys, I appreciate you all so much, but don't worry, you already have one iron golem in there, okay? You don't need to make any more. I have an iron farm. I'm, you know, putting your brothers and sisters into purgatory, okay? So you don't need to worry about getting me any more iron. You can just relax in there. Then we just need to go around and start placing all of these signs at eye level. Okay. Everything should be good and done. We just now need... Please. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Okay, why did... Where did you get white? Is that actually in the right spot? I can't tell. Why did it go on that one? I was aiming for this. What the hell is your issue? Yeah, no. Uh -uh. I'm, I'm, no, mm -mm. nope, not, not leaving you there. I'm gonna be stubborn, okay? I wanted you there. There we go. See, I wanted you to go around just like that. Perfect. See, much more beautiful. Okay, hi, everyone. Oh, how cool. There's no water. Or no air. Okay, uh. There we go. Water there. There we go. Okay, so hi, everyone. I'm really hoping that I built this correctly. So I... Oh, cool. You picked up one of my dirt. But I hope you guys are ready for some fun. Okay? Also, I just realized how, like, nice it is that he actually has armor on his head. So there's a absolutely zero chance of him ever you know, uh, catching on fire. I... Okay, no, I don't think he can actually reach them, so I'm pretty sure... 
Like, I'm 100% positive that this should be fine. Because I don't know how, but in one of my series before, he kept infecting the villagers, and I don't understand why. So, like, I don't know how he was able to reach them and stuff, but, like, ever since then, I'm just, like, scarred from iron farms and stuff. But, yeah, anyways, okay, so at least now it's actually working. Just need to let it run for quite some time. And then, very luckily, instead of it, you know, being a 100 days, you know, I could just AFK in this world and, and, you know, next episode we can come back to, like, half of a double chest full of iron. I just want to hit you. Yes, yes, give me that XP. Actually, wait, do iron golems even drop XP? No, they don't. Yes, okay, good. It's actually close enough to my base over there for it to keep working. Because for whatever reason, in the one block series on the main channel, it just doesn't like to work that far out from like a my, my, my normal base so i just i never understood like the uh, the distance of it okay but there we go and then i just like to always do this because i'm weird like i don't really have an explanation for that <laughs> just for organization so when you go there you can just immediately grab iron you don't have to like keep dodging any flowers in there oh and since that's finally done and made i want to automate you i'm really tired of having to do that by hand because you know just i'm, I'm, a, I'm a baby girl you know like what can i say <laughs> Because let's see, double chest hopper you. Just need two hoppers. Gorgeous. Okay, nice, I think. We might actually just be really kind because I'm worried that this episode is too short, so we might just be kind to future me. Uh, first off, I'm gonna go and chop down these again, but we might be really kind to future me and at least start the area to where we're gonna be doing all of our villager trades. Like that might be a good idea, but oh God, I guess like I'm trying to think of like what all, what, what's gonna be like an easy uh, material to delete in the future because I'm definitely not making their permanent place right now. Okay. Okay, phew, the entire rainforest is gone. We can now put those in there, don't need to do that manually. Hello, beautiful, and there we go with a metric ton of coal coming in, or charcoal coming in. Nice, I got Perfect with all of those. How did you not grow but like everything else is almost completely uh, grown? And then, yeah, I, I think we're gonna be very kind to feature me just to help out because I, I'm i now like realizing how much I'm planning for episode three. So like, I know you guys would hate like a four or like five hour long episode. So yeah, let's at least start that. Like I'm almost thinking just make the ground out of dirt. You know? Oh God, wait, I don't even have that much honey. Oh no, that's right. I haven't really been focusing on my uh, my bees. Oh, thank God those are actually like finally completely grown. Now it doesn't look so empty and sad. Oh, nice, and since we now have an iron farm, I don't need to care about iron whatsoever. So we should probably start harvesting you because I do plan on making sticks and possibly iron traits like our main uh, way of just getting emeralds, you know? I, I, don't, I don't know what term to use. <laughs> Whoa. Nice. Almost all of our stuff is, you know, getting uh, completely full on charcoal. Okay, thank God. Uh, at least now we don't have to go mining that much. Um. Ooh, okay. Now let's actually worry about you guys. That makes me nervous. Only two in there? Okay, no, no. We, we gotta start breeding the bees, but before we start breeding the bees, I need to give them a way bigger area to actually move around, and also so they don't try and leave the gorgeous prison I made them. And there we go. Okay, this should be, you know, a big enough size for all of them. Now I just need to light it up. I don't want anything spawning on here. Okay, then, actually, here, let's just break into here and make it nice and easy. My god, is it dark. Oh my god, I actually almost made a little mob spawner. Okay, hi bees. Um, okay, we might have to be really fast at removing all of those little campfires. Actually, we need to remove like everything in here. Please just don't touch the campfires, please.
I know, look, wow, you have so much more room in here. Wow, it, isn't it so nice? It makes you guys just, you know, want to try and never leave the building, right? right? Here, let's let's go ahead and start moving these. How about you guys, you know, come, come party back here. There you go. Okay, let's play this safe. Am I able to break these? Yes. <gasps> oh my god, you're so lame! Oh my god. Have I mentioned how much I love bees? Like, they're just so cool. Okay, why am I able to remove beehives from my hardcore world without them attacking me? But in this one, they're just, you know, demonetizable words, you know? Like, they're they're, they're just not nice at all. Yes, who's probably gonna have to go hunting? Yeah, I hate you. I guess who's gonna probably have to go around and start hunting for some more bees? This guy. Woo! Duh. No. You stay in there. But are you dead? Oh yeah, you're dead. Doesn't matter. Oh wait, 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 wait. We might not actually need uh need flowers, flowers, flowers. I might not actually need to go and find new bees if I can quickly just breed them. I just oh dude, I hope to God that they don't go back into their little beehives. I'm, oh no, it's almost nighttime. They're gonna go back into their beehives. Oh, I don't remember if I have two or three bees. Are you guys still out? Only one of you. Ah, come on, come on, come on, come on. Dude, if I have to go hunting for more bees, that's gonna be a pay cut to Darman, come on. Okay, let's see, are you good? No, you're the dying one. Okay, please, someone just come out, come out, come out. No! <laughs> please, please, for the love of God, tell me that there's two in here still, please. <gasps> there is. I think there's one in there, one in there. Okay, let's... Since they're gonna take, like, half of a century, let's just... Do this. I don't know how many I need to make. <coughs> it was me. I think at the very least I need nine, but let's go see if that's correct. Hi. I hate you guys. Okay, at least you still have your stinger. Yeah, there's still one in there. Okay. Phew. Hi, buttholes. Okay, so... So you and you, oh, dude, I was so worried I would actually have to like go and travel around and like do work. Oh, that's cool. Some of them are going to be placed different ways. Dang it. <laughs> Forgot that they do that. Oh my God, I'm so smart. I did the exact amount. Okay, I need just four more trap doors. We also need to make some shears so I can make more beehives. Do I have shears? Of course I do. Okay, let's try this. Okay, you're not mad at me? Oh, no, no, yeah, that's right. Okay, good, good. See, you guys are finally reasonable because of all the smoke right there. I just don't know what to expect from them nowadays. You know, they're just weird. How? I don't know how you spawned in. I don't think I've been uh, letting it get too dark. Okay, now for this fun part. Nope, you're not touching me. Okay, while he comes down, come here. I'd be really appreciative if you didn't hit me at all and you dropped your bow. Oh, you actually survived that. Whoop, missed me. Eh, looks like an arrow, why not? Okay, let's see, are you mad? You're still a little grumpy? Aw, I showed you a little grumpy wumpy in there. Aw, you will, you, you will matty waddy, aw. Okay, I think he's done because I don't really hear any more buzzing. I'm so scared to do this. Hi, there you go. God, I love it when you guys don't try to like run out of here and you're so reasonable. Okay, and then- <gasps> No! Oh, oh, okay, wait. I think me actually breaking that just saved them because they were just gonna, you know, let themselves sit on the campfire because bees are just so smart in this game. Please relax, I just want to finish this. <laughs> Please. Oh dear God, will you just relax, little one? There you go. God, you're like a four foot 11 girl. Just stop. No, no, uh-uh. Nope, you're not ending yourself, okay? It's not that bad living in here. There we go. That should at least keep them all protected. It's like the campfires are so nice, but they're just, they're so stupid. But you gotta love them. They're just such cute little idiots. Kind of like every other mob in this game. I don't know why, like, their AI or their NPCs, you know, just like the scripting on them is just so bad. And then I'm pretty positive there's actually some bees near me and I kind of just... What? New ones actually spawned here? How? Wait, wait, wait. Ooh. Okay, good idea. Right. 
Um. What? I'm just as confused as you, bud. Um, huh. Uh. Like, Darman, kiss me if I'm wrong, but like, I swear my life when there is a beehive and you don't have silk touch and you break it, I thought the bees were supposed to, you know, spawn out of it and start chasing me. So I was just going to like run back to my house. Once they calm down, I'd pick them up and then put them inside of the, the little beehive area, but I guess not. Little funky. Um, speaking of funky, we should also... My axe is almost broken. Uh, I just came here for nothing. So what I was going to say is that we should probably harvest all of the trees over there around the mine, just so it's like nice and open, and also just so I can get all of that wood and turn into charcoal, so I can stay on top of that. What interesting stuff. Here you go, little bud. You can go play with the chickens. They're like the same height as you. Like I was like just chasing me down. Oh, he is so mad at me. He's so mad at me. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't realize that like, you know, you being with all the animals would just make you that little grumpy wumpy. My word. Okay, let's see. How are you guys doing in here though? Okay. Yeah, we really need to focus on those bees. And speaking of bees, how is our iron farm doing before we go back to the forest? <laughs> Could be worse. Maybe. Oh, actually, here, since I have the shears as well, we should... I don't know why I'm not bringing my donkey with me. Like, we're going to be getting a lot of wood, but whatever. But um, let's also collect some of the leaves. Because I already know, like, even in future builds, I'm just going to need a lot of leaves. So might as well start now. So here's another tip if you're going around just cutting down a whole lot of things and you're worried that you're just not picking up everything. If you just turn on the little hit boxes, like, wowee, it's so easy to spot all of the items. And then if you have a tree cutting mod on, just leave that very top one and boop, still registers as a tree. Oh my god, how many trees did I plant? My god, I'm gonna need like four axes for this entire place, jeez. Yeah, a little awkward. Okay, so I guess I should have brought in four, my bad. Should probably bring back some flowers for all the bees just to stay on top of those. Like, oh, I cannot wait until we're not in the beginning part of the world. <laughs> Uh, I love being in like in-game Minecraft where you can just do so many more like just massive cool things. There's just so much to do and so little time. Okay, let's see. Hi. Any bees out here? Okay. Mwah. Mwah. There we go. Hello. Okay, can you and you? Yes, good. Okay, another baby coming in. Okay, don't go to the front door. No, that's okay. You can go over here. There we go. Oh my word. Eh, not bad. We actually clicked out a decent amount. Don't care for these. Oh my god, that's so many saplings. And then while we're out, we might as well just start cooking up all of you. Donkey! Donkey boy, yes please. I'm, I'm tired of running it. You're like a little bit faster than me. I wonder if I could, like, force him to break it. No. There we go. Much better. Yeah, me... God, I'm trying to think of, like, when should we... Because I need to make a test. Uh, I, I need to do, like, some redstone things. And then we could do a test with donkeys and horses. And then I think to get, like, the fastest mule possible, you just have to get a horse... Like, the, the, the fastest speed of a horse and the fastest speed of a donkey. And then you breed them... And then it should give you the fastest mule, which I think at that point it'd be like, what? Like 14 blocks in a second. And it should also be able to carry a uh, chest. It's like, I, I think that's how it works. Which will be interesting. It'll be the first time I've ever done that in this. And here you go. Do not wander off. Oh my God, there's so many trees. Please, please, we need them gone, please. It can't be that many more, right? Did you just grow right in front of me? Whew. Okay, well, everything is finally gone that I planted over here. And I honestly, at this point with how much like uh, charcoal I'm going to be getting from all this, I don't think we're ever going to have to worry about fuel for quite some time. And then by the time that I probably have to start worrying about it, we're just going to be using bamboo. Oh man, but I have to go to the nether so I can get some of that, uh, the quartz... 
<sighs> no, let's see. Okay. Uh, what do you, what do you personally want? Uh, episode three. Do you think I should go into the nether and, you know, get some nether quartz and we start like, uh, making some farms and then, uh, we'll do a little bit of the villagers. Probably focus on, you know, making more bees, focus on getting items, like building blocks and stuff. Or in episode three, should I strictly focus on villagers and just getting all the enchantments, getting diamond armor and tools, you know, just very quickly getting uh, just god armor and, you know, becoming invincible, you know? Uh, which one would you rather see in episode three? Because if I'm doing the nether stuff and, like, focusing on making, like, an automatic bamboo farm and, you know, just other automatic farms, like, there's no way I'm gonna have enough time to do all of the villager stuff, too. Okay, I think I actually managed to run around and pick up everything. I don't think anything despawned. Four iron axes later. Oh my god, that is so much wood. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, so that'll give us a magic ton of fuel. And, you know, just torches and all that other nice things. Okay, I think we're all good here. Okay, let's go, donkey. Dude, are you good? Like, why... Why do you just, like, really want to get over to me? Why do all the chickens love that one donkey? Oh, dear God. Well... Ugh... I'm trying so hard to not make any more furnaces. Like, do I really need more? Because I'm just so low on coal. Not coal. Cobblestone. I think I only have 28 more cobblestone and then we're completely out. Uh, let's make two more. We're just gonna make two more. We're gonna be stupid. There you go. Uh, I think we're fine like that. We just have so much to get through. Okay, next up. Uh... Okay, I see one of them is actually done in there. Let's go get some more shears. We're so low on everything. This is so depressing. Don't be mad. There we go. See, that's the bees that I'm used to, you know, or they don't want to slaughter me for literally doing nothing to them. Except actually keep them safe. Okay, don't come out. Don't come out. There we go. Now, if I'm remembering correctly, there should be some bees near the house and i kind of want to run around and see if i could find them and then just like bring them back home i'm trying to remember which area i saw them i almost want to say maybe this way i would take the donkey but i don't think i can actually ride the donkey while carrying something but just to speed up time i want to go and get more bees i've never collected pumpkins before really oh. imagine if breeding bees with like very specific flowers made them do different things like, imagine if, uh, if the dandelions just made it so, like, they, you know, can breed faster. <laughs> or, like, if you use, like, a rose, then, you know, two babies can come out. Like, if you use, um, like a poppy, I don't know, it becomes explosive or something. I think that'd be kind of funny. However, I'm not going to travel too far because, like, even though I did see a bee, it's just... If I'm running miles, it's just better to AFK back at our house. Wait for the bees to get ready again and then just, you know, uh, give them more flowers. Because it's only slow in the beginning. I was just, I could have sworn that there was a bee or two, like, near the house. Like, somewhere out here. But I don't think bees can spawn in these savannas, so we're good there. That's a really weird looking jungle yeah oh well i may, maybe it was across the ocean that's probably where i saw him but i don't want to waste too much time i just want to collect these pumpkins we'll just get back home and then honestly i'm probably just going to start afking breed up the bees a little bit show you guys progress you know as time goes on and then also that'll let the iron farm go why is there always a really weird skeleton just like staring at me it's weird but at, at least you know we'll get some resources with that i'll probably actually no i was gonna say i'll stay up with the uh the forest that spawns right next to you know the base but um got a lot of wood to go through already really is it because i'm never around here so maybe this is like on the verge of the edge of like how efficient this is that's so weird okay so can't be that far from it. I wish that they just had, you know, render distance range. Like, I don't know why I have to be so close to it. Okay, let's see. How are my little princesses, huh? Of course, right when I put away my shears. Oh, God. Of course, everyone's going to be, like, right here. Okay, no one come over here to the fire. Okay, but wait... I swear to God, I heard another one come out. Okay, you know what? Uh, just give me some time. I'm, I'm just gonna start AFKing a lot of stuff, breeding the bees. I would ideally like to fill up every single hive, 
before this episode ends. <laughs> I would really like to, you know, have that many uh, bees working because, yeah, we're going to be needing a lot of honey. But at least they're so cute. Two hours later. All okay, right, so I've been doing a whole lot of just, you know, chores, I guess you can call them. So I kept on chopping that one down. We have a little bit of charcoal now. So, you know, now I should like really never have to worry about it. We got about like two stacks of iron from our iron farm. So that was awesome. Started breeding the sheep a little bit. And then now for the important part. So I now have 12 honey blocks, you know, I made 12 glass bottles. I've been breeding them a little bit. I went out and collected more flowers. Like I'm just trying to stay on top of this because I mean, we don't exactly need, you know, honey blocks to make all of the uh, the villagers stuff. It's just, I like using honey blocks on the floor so that then when they stand on it, they can't jump. And then it's kind of easier to access them uh, when you're trying to trade. So, it, like, we don't have to get it. Um, I don't remember how, but, like, I have so much dirt. And I don't really think that I need to prepare anything for the villagers. Again, like, if... If that's what you guys want episode three to be, which I'm really hoping that it is because, oh my God, I don't want to do the other stuff yet. And then it might actually be easier for me to do the other stuff with maxed out armor and tools. So yeah, uh, hopefully that's not going to be episode three. Now, I don't really know why I'm just keeping up with the farm, but yeah, well, we can make a, uh, a farming villager because, oh my God, I have so much food. <laughs> oh, and I also went through and I just uh, kind of cleaned out all of the chests. So we have like a little bit more room in there. Uh, but I think... I think that's like basically everything that I wanted to do for this one because up next, I got, I think we're just entirely ready for the villagers. Like there's just really nothing else to do. Like, you know, we, we got to make some emerald trades with a lot of them, start working on the librarians, the armorer, the weaponsmith. Oh my God, that sounds like so much fun. And then for the most part, I mean, for the most part, like the bees are pretty done. Like we're, we're getting to a point to where they actually make honey incredibly fast. I didn't want to put that down. Uh, let's see. You're good. There you go. But yeah, for the most part, you know, the bees are all good. We're, we're doing well on this front. We should also make this automated. Which, that just becomes a lot more tedious. So, maybe... Actually, mm, no. We should probably automate it once we actually make, like, our, uh, our forever home. You know, like, make the good build. But do you guys want me to build with concrete or like do you want me to try another block i just like building with concrete just because like it looks so clean and like futuristic and that uh, i i like to try and build with that style because like i'm just getting burnt out of like all the wooden styles and like stone plus i just feel like that's just so common for people to build with so at least with concrete it really stands out and it's just something unique and then i guess like a cool thing just to keep track of would you guys want darman just to post like a, a, in the beginning of the episode like we'll just flash what day it is like in the world currently so like yeah for episode three like we'll just have like day 56 like fade away like in the center of the screen and then like we just do that for like every single episode just so you guys can tell like, uh, how much time is going on or, like, moving along uh, in each episode. Might be a fun thing. Who knows? I feel like you guys would like it. However, very sadly, that's the end of this episode. I promise you guys, not next week, but the week after that, uh, there, there, it'll be episode three, okay? Don't worry. We're, we're starting the bi-weekly uploads. I'm, I'm not forgetting about this series. I am enjoying this world and I want to progress in here, you know, don't, don't worry. But every other week, there should be an episode of this series, you know, and we'll just keep going until I either run out of things to do in the world or I get burnt out, but I don't see myself getting burnt out in here because this is such a laid back series. So... Thank you guys very much for watching. Hopefully you can answer all my questions. Give me some feedback on all those things. And yeah, I'll see you guys in like two weeks uh, you know, for the series. <laughs> see ya.